This photograph, I'm going to tell you right off the top, is as hard for us to look at as it probably is for you right now. But this photo captures the reality of families battling pediatric cancer. A Princeton mom shared that heart-wrenching image with her son, sick from leukemia treatments, being comforted by his big sister. Gilma Avalos tonight with the story behind this now viral photo. Like all siblings, Wait. <laughs> Aubrey and Beckett give each other a hard time. Mom. Being so close in age isn't easy, but they always have each other's back. This is what pediatric cancer looks like. She was rubbing my back. Little Beckett, still in diapers, sick to his stomach from his leukemia treatment. Aubrey, right by his side. They don't really see the behind closed doors. They don't see the effects it has on the family. By sharing this photo of the reality of pediatric cancer, Caitlin Burge is letting people in and bringing awareness to some hard truths. He's burned to the core. You touch him, he's hot to the touch. So he's very, um, he's a trooper. Beckett is a trooper, diagnosed last April. His hair since grown back, though his treatment leaves him flushed. But it takes a toll on the entire family. Beckett and Aubrey's youngest sibling can't stay in the house right now. The family's been split up. Chandler's been sent to my brother's because of the risk of infection. And it's just, it's been hard. And another hard truth. All pediatric cancers combined receive less than 4% of cancer research federal funding. If people don't see it and they don't see the raw photos, I mean, you can't raise the awareness. And to raise awareness, this family shares the good, too. Beckett's strong. Beckett There's just strong. something about a sibling's love. When I don't feel well, Aubrey feels happy. They're there to help you when you mix up your words. Actually, she feels sad. And there for you when you just need a hand. And we are happy to share that Beckett is in remission. He still has to go through some harsh treatment so that the cancer doesn't come back. But they expect to be wrapped up with treatment by the summer of 2021. And like his mom said, he's a trooper, but clearly so is the entire family. One of these courageous kids, man. There's so many of them. The, the, the remission thing, for those who have not been in the fight before, uh, remission happens fairly early in the treatment process usually. And then, as you mentioned, there's still a long road to go. Don't, don't let the word remission fool you. Right. Until 2021, they're planning on treatment. So he's in what they call the maintenance phase of the treatment, Doug. All right, beautiful. And 